I've been involved in Loyola Robotics since 1998. I started as a student and I really, really enjoyed it, so much so that I stayed and have been volunteering ever since. So I've been a volunteer in some way, shape or form since 2003 and have been to many competitions all around the world, including Mexico, because of robotics. So I'm, yeah, I'm very, very grateful for the experience that I've had and it really is thanks to this program that I've experienced what I have. So this is my first year and uh, I've learned a lot so far from uh, mentors and also fellow students and I've really had a lot of fun. This is a very interesting year. We've gotten a massive growth spurt. We're right around 60 students. So that includes students both from Loyola and from Sacred Heart. I joined robotics at uh, around September at the beginning of this year. I really enjoy the friendships that you make and uh, just uh, the gaining of new knowledge and the things that you learn and just the entire uh, environment that uh, surrounds you. So the premise of the competition is that teams from all around the world have six weeks to design and to build and to practice with and to program a robot. It's a very, very intense time and it's really amazing to see the creations of all of the teams. This year I'm really looking forward to uh, winning the competition but also uh, learning ro about robots, about building them, and also uh, making uh, some friends along the way. Most of the volunteers that come back and help are themselves alumni, and most of them themselves, again, are engineers. So it's really great to have all of that experience, not just from the robotics program itself, but also from some industrial work. It's really fantastic to have all of those people. So my name is Brandon Fergara. I'm a mentor on uh, Team 296, the Northern Knights. It's a team comprised of both Sacred Heart students and Loyola High, uh, Loyola High School students. Um, working with this team, I've recognized that some of our students have actually, their math grades have improved as, being, uh, as a result of being members of this team. Uh, and they attribute it to their, their desires or their recognition of the, of the need for math in a pursuit of engineering. Uh, so their math grades have improved since joining the team. And it's been quite an accomplishment uh, as mentors to see that. During the course of the competition season, it's our job as mentors to make sure that the kids go from absolute beginners to having a pretty good experience and a pretty good knowledge of robotics. So whether that's programming or design, a lot of construction, assembly, or driving on the field, it's really our job to make sure that they have an experience in that. A lot of our mentors that do come back uh, as volunteers, as mentors of this team, uh, have actually pursued a career in engineering, uh, and they attribute their time on the team uh, to the reason why they actually pursued that uh, academia in engineering. Uh, it's been a pleasure to work with them, and they continue to uh, impress and, and, and you know, encourage the students uh, to pursue careers in STEM.